Hey guys, Rook Knight here. Thanks for joining me. I wanted to talk to you about leashes and the pick tips. Did you know they break? And if so, did you know they're replaceable? Um, I actually replaced mine successfully and it works fantastic. And I figure I would do the video of how I did it in case somebody else runs into the same problem. They can do a quick fix under five minutes and have it repaired. Of course, you got to first buy the new picking tip. And once that gets in the mail, here's the next clip and showing you how I did it. All right, guys, so we got this leashy here and we're gonna wanna replace the pick tip. As you can see, pick tip has a little bit of damage there and we have the new pick here that we gotta replace. The problem is they kind of forge weld or friction weld this shut. You can see an attempt at trying to get it open. Um, I'm gonna show you here the way to get it open. Um, the best thing to do is to get yourself a screwdriver, very thin and very flat, and if it's, uh, gotta try to get it underneath here and if it's still too big you actually can take and get a, and file it find an older screwdriver and file it you want to get it so it'll slip right underneath next to the picking uh part there so we're gonna install it into here just enough to, to grab it and we're gonna take a small little hammer we're gonna take this and try to pry open just the back here a little bit and then even if it falls off completely it's not a big deal because this goes on and gets screwed on with an allen wrench so it would still seal it up tight so we're just going to take and whack it a couple times and we'll see if we can get it no nope. we're going to push this off to the side come around this other side here There we go. I think we got it this time. I have to put this in maybe why we're trying to extract it. Maybe one more time. It still wants to be a little stubborn. Oh, I think we're getting caught up here on this tip itself, actually. So let me just pull this out of the way. Oh, there we go. We're out. We just got to manipulate it a little bit more. Okay, so the problem is the old tip. Whoop. The old tip is bent so much that it's given problems to coming out. We're going to put our screwdriver in there. And then attempt on trying to finagle this to come out the rest of the way. The tip is bent, so it's having problems coming out. So this might actually be a real world situation for you as well. And there we go. We're out, guys. Now what we're going to do is take the new pick tip, we're going to slide it in there. Going to got to find the sweet spot for it to, to connect in there. Maybe you might have to help it a little bit. All right, and we're in. And now what we're gonna do is we're gonna just take this part here, make sure we got it the right direction, which way would it go? We're gonna install this, and that's what's gonna tighten it back up again. Go back on the opposite side, tighten it up, and we have a fully restored leashy pick. There we go, guys. Pretty simple, real quick, and uh, we got a workable pick again. That's all I got, guys. Thanks for watching.